You're ready. Go ahead. Hello and welcome to Schoology. This video is presented by school-based technology specialists from the West Springfield Pyramid, representing Orange Hunt, Cardinal Forest, Rolling Valley, Keene Mill, Hunt Valley, West Springfield Elementary, Irving Middle School, and West Springfield High School. Today we will touch on the main subjects of background on Schoology and what a learning management system is, how you can log into your account, the differences between parents and student accounts, grade books, communication, and how to get some help. Schoology is a learning space that enhances communication, collaboration, and personalized learning for students, teachers, and families. An LMS, or learning management system, allows for students, teachers, and families to communicate, participate in classes, collaborate, and view calendars and grades. Teachers can post assignments and students can complete and submit assignments in the platform. Learning management systems deliver 21st century teaching and learning tools. So let's get logged into our Schoology accounts. You need to have an active student information system or SIS parent view account to be able to log into your Schoology parent account. The same username and password are used to access both the SIS parent view and Schoology. Now that you have activated your SIS parent view account, you're ready to log in. Go to lms.fcps.edu or click on the Schoology link on your school's website. Do not Google Schoology to log in and do not go to schoology.com to log in. If you are not using FCPS's URL, you may accidentally get to a general Schoology login or a login from another school system, such as Frederick County Public Schools. When you visit lms.fcps.edu, you will see the Fairfax County Public Schools logo. Ensure you are at the right place. You will log in using your SIS parent username and password. So let's learn a little bit more about the similarities and differences between the parent and the student accounts. When viewing your child's account, you can see his or her classes, upcoming assignments and announcements, and links to other FCPS resources. As a parent, you only have the ability to read student activities. Parents cannot participate as students. Your student will have access to other FCPS websites and resources right within Schoology. Your Schoology account is like having two different accounts. You have access to your own account as well as all of your children's accounts. You can easily switch between both accounts. Parents have read-only ability to student activities. Parents are not able to participate as students. When you click on your name in the top right corner, your children will be listed below. Switch between students. Click on their names. You will see a green check mark indicating which account you are currently viewing. Once you're in your student's account, you will see a blue bar indicating which student course you are in an account. When you first enter your student's account, you will see the student activity page. Updates from courses and groups will be shown here. You can view your child's recent updates, submitted assignments, recent, recently graded assignments, grades, overdue items, and upcoming events from their home dashboard. Under courses, you can view specific courses your child is enrolled in. If you click into an assignment and do not have access, it might be a Google material. Google files can only be seen through an FCPS Google account. Please log in with your child under their account to view any Google materials. 
You can also see how your student calendar looks. Your child can also color code from different courses. Did you know that Schoology has a gradebook feature? This is FCPS's gradebook of record. Not all assignments that are in Schoology are graded, and not all schools are using the gradebook feature. Check with your child's teacher to hear more about this feedback feature. Schoology is an excellent place to learn not only about upcoming assignments, but also special events and important updates. Parents may see grades in Schoology. Some grades in Schoology may simply be activities to help with student learning and may not be considered official grades that go into SIS. Elementary schools may not be using the gradebook feature at this time. Parents can receive notifications via email or mobile alerts for various reasons. Though you can turn your mobile notifications and email notifications on and off, we would recommend not turning all notifications off. Make sure your notifications for school updates stay on. You can choose to get an email digest of your child's activity in Schoology. To turn on an email digest in your parent account, you will switch to view your child's account. You will select settings and then go to the notifications tab. An important thing for teachers and parents to know, the digest email can get very long and Gmail automatically clips it. You may have to click view more at the bottom of the email to see everything. Utilizing Schoology has a lot of different resources for you. Here are some helpful information and tips as you are in the learning environment. For Fairfax County, there is a number of supports. You go to www.fcps.edu backslash Schoology backslash support. You have access to a number of resources on how to log in, where to find information and more. Here are also a number of resources that are quick glances for you to access information about Schoology as well as your SIS account. There's also information both here and on your school websites that incorporates technology support for families. From all of us in the West Springfield Pyramid, we wanna thank you for tuning in to this quick video about Schoology. Again, to get to the resources for Schoology, make sure you are going to our website fcps.edu backslash Schoology. Thank you all. Have a good school year.